What's up, RC gang? We back with another video. We are doing Ask Seeing Jay, where y'all send in y'all questions, and we right give in you, the middle of the storm. We give you our honest advice. Okay. So let's go. Before you even watch this video, give it a thumbs up because you already know you're gonna like it. So question one: One of my elders who was married has gotten too close to me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! He's told me the way he feels and always calls me beautiful, but also he said. It, We'll never be more than friends because of the obvious circumstances and significant age gap. Do the age even matter? We just become so close because I've gone through a, a lot the past couple of years and he's helped me through it all. Now at the hall, it's awkward between him and I and we don't speak that much. Something like this has never happened to me before. And somehow I feel like, th like it's my fault. How do we go back to the relationship we had before? Or should I just keep the talking to a minimum so I don't carry things on further than they have already gotten. I miss what made it awkward though. The He's thing married. Is, no. <laughs> <laughs> At what point did it change? He told her that he told he told her the way he feels and I was causing oh. beautiful so he caught the crush on that. And he's been <laughs> I find that when you just act normal Instead of like making it a thing, like don't focus. He, he <laughs> told her. No, she said, but the question is, how do we just go back to being normal? Right. Just be normal. But if you already know that somebody like you. Yeah, but just don't act different. <laughs> Coming from you. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? Like, you know what I mean? You know what I mean. <laughs> keep it to a minimum, but keep it to a minimum. Cut it off. Cut and it don't off. be with him by yourself. It ain't nothing that cut that. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, next question. Oh, Don't delete it because I want to know. <laughs> it's I thought of this. No, but you I found a new but, thing. But I found a new, new link. Yeah, I'm using Lipsy, y'all, so y'all can see y'all questions. I have a link below. But um, yeah, I'm gonna reply back to them because you can reply back to a person on this. So four years ago, I was talking to this. If they have that. So four years ago, I was talking to this brother in my circle for like almost six months, and we ended up stopped talking because we were young and said some things that shouldn't been said and we stopped talking for a year after that. We stopped talking for a year. After that year we became really good friends and now four years later we're still friends but now he has this girlfriend and won't talk to me and now I heard they're gonna get married and you could and you could now what what's she trying to say? Oh and now that he's getting married I'm now that he's getting married I miss him and and she doesn't know what to do. So, so you it, missed their friendship. Was it not clear on what you all were? But back in the day. Before they got married. But back in the day they had a little something going on. But they stopped talking and just was friends. But he found somebody else. Just move on. That's right. Gonna say. It's going to take time. Going to take time what? To get about over him. him. And you're going to be seeing him. Um, post it up. They about to get married right? They hadn't got married yet. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's gonna be a lot of media if they're that type of people. <laughs> a lot of media? Yeah, like Instagram posts, <laughs> hashtag so and so wedding. <laughs> <laughs> hashtag bachelorette party. Hashtag <laughs> bridal shower. Bridal shower. <laughs> <laughs> hashtag I'm engaged. Hashtag I said yes. <laughs> hashtag two weeks left. <laughs> <laughs> oh gosh. So this question says Oh my god, I'm laughing. This question says how do you, oh this question says how do you know how do you know someone is interested in you? <laughs> Please let me know. This is we laughing because this is the inside of <laughs> So tell us. <laughs> <laughs> according to them, according to 
of them the signs that I get they say are invalid. So I'm not gonna answer this. Um, I think it's different with everybody. No, it's not. <laughs> you know. You know it's My not mama different. mama always told me if the person like you, oh, you know. And it ain't gonna be no mystery. So just take that. Yeah. Yep. Ain't that right, babe? That's what Lily said. Okay. Uh, so I was chatting with this brother, not really thinking anything about it. He'll flirt with me, I'll flirt back. But I wasn't trying to be with... I wasn't trying to be with him. He sent me money through the cash app. And I posted him him as my man crush money because he was being real cool, really cool. And then boom, he tells me he has mad feelings for me and etc. And I was like, she got that emoji. Because I didn't like him like that. And now he still wants to be friends. But it's weird and awkward now. I don't even know him. I don't even know him. Know him. I blame yeah. Instagram. I don't know what to do, and I don't like want to block him and delete his number, but it would be obvious. I know you lying. You flirted with him. And you, you took the money. Right and you took the money from his cash app. She finessed him. Why did he send money? I want to know. Because that. he liked her. He was flirting with her, and you flirted back, so you gave him the green light. Now that's what you call misleading. That's what you call misleading when you not knowing if a person is interested in you or not. You misled him big time. You flirted with him back. You took money. You accepted their cash app. And you posted him as your man Chris Monday. I would apologize. You need to apologize and tell him you misled him. You finessed him. That's gold digging. I'll put your cup in the video. Especially after you accept the money. <laughs> she accepted the fuzz and pulls up as a message for Monday. He has mad feelings for me. Wow. And y'all say we are dogs. She a dog. Bark for her. Bark. I will not. Bark for her. I will not. She That's is special. a dog. He sent the money. Kristen, he liked her. And she was flirting back with him. I know. That's why I said just apologize. That's it? She need to do more than apologize. Ain't nobody forcing him to send that money. <laughs> <laughs> just like the people on Catfish. She catfished him. <laughs> I'm calling Dean. That was it. That's all we have for today? Mm -hmm. Oh, y'all sent some more because, questions on this new app. Now yeah, I'm going to drop the, the link, link below. I'm going to drop the link below. Y'all can send in the questions. They are anonymous. Um, like, comment, subscribe. Give this video a thumbs up. Send in more questions. The only way that this is going to go, ask CJ, is if you send in questions. Oh,